one of our very own. Seven time Mac Award winner, Julie Gold. The challenge for me was to try and introduce Julie in a minute and a half. My first pass at the speech was over 10 minutes and I started to sweat. So the first thing I caught was the laundry list of awards that she had won, because if you don't know those by now, you've been living under a rock. I decided to focus on the pleasure that I've had over the past 10 years of working with you. We all at the Duplex feel incredibly grateful that she has chosen us as her performance home. Our staff always gets excited when it's a Julie night because they know that they are in for a treat as well as the audience. And any of you who work with cabaret staff, you know it's not very easy to get them excited about anything. <laughs> we, I always smile when Julie steps on our stage because the first thing she'll get into and say is, man, I love it here. The village is my hood. I live down the street, my dry cleaner's right over there, and not too far away is a tiny apartment where I wrote the song that changed my life. Friends and peers adore and respect her. Some of the incredible stars that have guested in her show are her friends. Christine Lavin, Stephen Flaherty, the Bacon Brothers, and two of our other honorees tonight, Urban Drake and John Bacchino. The night that John guested on her night, he turned to me and said, Oh my God, she's wonderful. I feel like I've been wrapped in a musical hug. She makes me want to perform again. Julie's Grammy Award winning song, From a Distance, has been translated into numerous languages, which makes her current project so very cool to me. She works with University Oxford Press, writing music to teach English to grade schoolers around the world. Now I can't think of a better ambassador to bring English to children than Julie, because her love and joy shines through everything that she does. At the start of March Madness, I mean March is Cabaret Month, I, they're synonymous to me, I asked Julie to host the Mac Song and Special Material Showcase, and she did graciously. She said, anytime you want to use me for Mac, please do. At the performance, one of the performers, Sally Wilford, had to leave early. But before she did, she grabbed me and said, oh my god, I don't want to go. This is a wonderful evening. Julie is truly amazing. I feel like I have been healed at a revival. I had a laugh, because that is not the first time I've heard that comment about a Julie Gold show. Being around Julie, Watching her perform, listening to her music, just makes you feel good. That's the effect she has on people. So while we are recognizing her songwriting abilities tonight, we are truly honoring a beautiful, gracious, loving human being. Please welcome to the stage, Julie Gold. Yeah.
this song, The Journey, was first recorded by the great Leia Salonga. And after that, Kathy Lee Gifford recorded it. And I would come home, and my answering machine would be flashing, and people would say, we heard Kathy Lee Gifford, and she mentioned your name on TV, and she sang your song. It was a great thrill for, for me and for my family. I'm a unreliable player at best, and uh, my singing will clear the house. They should have had me last. <laughs> but I wrote this, and many great friends in cabaret have sung it. Uh, Tom Anderson and uh, Anna Bergman and uh, Reza Katona, Bennett, and I thank you uh, for honoring me all these years by singing my songs, giving them life, giving them meaning, giving my life meaning. So I would like to uh, play this for you now with my new hip. <laughs> I can see. 